What is up, ladies and gentlemen? My name is Will Cashin, aka White Trash Willie, sitting alongside my team manager. If you guys didn't know, I ride for the District Scooters. I mentioned that in previous videos before. You know, that's a really big secret. I don't tell anybody I'm team manager. That's like a really big secret. Really? That's not public information. Don't message him about getting on District, because that's not the way to do it. Alright guys, so today we're coming at you with a video pretty similar to a videos that I've done in the past with Clayton normally. We're similar to an edit review, but we're doing something a little bit different. Today we're going to be doing a scooter check review. And if you guys have been in the scooter community for a long time, you guys are pretty familiar with scooter checks. Basically it's a video being like, this is my deck, this is my wheels, this is my fork. But we're not just going to show you your average scooter check, we're going to show you the best scooter checks in history. You you guys ready to dive into this? I'm ready. I, I have watched maybe two in my entire life, so... You think? Yeah, let's, let's have a look. Alright, alright. The first video that we're going to review is actually called The World's Farthest Scooter Check Plus Clips. Or in English, that would be furthest. World's furthest scooter check. Oh, we're with an English in man real, right in, now. In real English, though. Um, this video... The long-awaited four subscribers special. Ooh, Who this, is this? Please ship my bars. <laughs> Alright, so here we go. World's farthest scooter check. Let's dive into it. Hey, what's up, guys? I'm down here at the beautiful Merrimack River. I just want to say He's quite far away. He is pretty far drivers, away. So I'm going to give you a scooter check. Right? <laughs> here we go. He is just so <laughs> tiny in the frame. So the grips, I got the standard ODI long neck. I like how it's not a great angle like to look at the bar. <laughs> uh, don't side around too much. Standard ODI classic, plastic bar ends. I'm glad he's got a microphone there. Yeah, no, I know. That's tight. I wonder if the cord goes all the way <laughs> to the camera. <laughs> no, it is a corded mic though. Like them a lot. They've lasted me a long time. Uh, compression. I'm running just standard Proto SCS. You got the standard Proto SCS. He could literally be naming any parts that are not his. Yeah, no, like you have no if, if you look at it, like. I mean, it's black, that's about it. I don't know what's on that. You can have one wheel or ten. I don't know. I'm blind anyway. I wear glasses. I can't see anything right now. Very true. What do you th that guy was walking across. What do you think he's doing? He has no clue. Absolutely no clue what's going on. You know, sliders are always good. Oh my god, who's got who the part of the sliders on? Who is this guy? How do you, why did you pick this one? Who, do you know him? I, okay, so I was in the scooter farm one day and I was asking, I was like, because John Dev and Tommy Christian were like watching this video, like, what are you guys watching? And that's what they were. And it was the world's farthest scooter check. This is standard TSI. And the clip's gonna be really far away. Let me, uh, let me do a quick. I have no idea. I have never, I haven't even watched this video all the way through. It's just so interesting. The drop test. <laughs> I like how you put the bike to the drop <laughs> test. Hey, thanks for watching. You're for welcome, checking bro. It out. That's my scooter. <laughs> <laughs> Just... My man's on the moon building this. Oh, no way. It's all the way across the lake. <laughs> you know what? I, I think he's right about the world's problem. Oh, I wish the clips were that far away. That'd be even funnier. <laughs> Scooter check and world's part of the scooter check. <laughs> Got a finger up the people over that with American flag. <laughs> Manny, oh Manny Yo, Ross. That's, that's one of my favorite tricks ever because of Matt McKean's one. You did a Manny, you know? <laughs> Directed by Robert. <laughs> All right. Well, this video was made by at Dak Pack, so y'all need to go check him out at Dak Pack. <laughs> wow, that was an inspiring scooter check. Shout out to Dak Pack, and that's it. And oh. that's the whole video. The variation of scooter check I thought I would see. <laughs> Next like, different, like in a funny suit or something, or whatever. Not not 3,000 miles away. Dude, next one is gonna be that world's cool. world's closest scooter check. Just like, just like, just pixels moving across the screen. No, I'd be in a microscope. <laughs> like, a, yeah. a, like a, each fragment of a part, like <laughs> a few cells of a, yeah. It's not, I mean, I don't feel like it's got the amount of views it deserves. For the entertainment value. Hey, we're, we're part of the 272 view crew. What more can we ask? Well, for? when he posted, he had four subscribers. Now he's got 144. This video got. My some, man's growing. This man is growing fast. My man's making movement. <laughs> Go check him out, guys. At Dak Pack or please, please ship my bars. Oh, All right. Damn. All right. You know the next. You know the next video coming up. So for you guys that don't know, 
Lewis Crampton. He's kind of a he's kind of a legend for this video. This was one of my this is one of my favorite videos to watch way back in the day. And I thought, what better time to review this video with the man himself? Well, I want to say one thing about this is that no one ever saw this because we used the song. It was banned off mobiles immediately. So like no one sees like people who watch this on their phone they they can't actually go and watch this video separately because the song is me. You can't watch it on your mobile. So if you're watching this on your mobile. This is like a special way to watch this. Maybe they have, maybe people's first time if they're on their mobile right now. I, I hope so. I mean, if like... And it was like four years ago. When, when was it? Oh, it was five years ago. Five years ago. August 31st, 2013. Oh man. All right, well, let's dive into this. Let's go. All right, we... We got some bed sheets. Oh, the, the iPhone 3G, bro. The iPhone 3G. That's how old this video is. Oh, man. Man, you were just balling, Lewis. Oh, I'm just gonna... I just wanna make a point, because one of the most common comments in this video is, yo, nice, nice fake money, bro. <laughs> not fake money, like, that's not my jam. I'll explain why we had money in the first place, <laughs> like, in a sec. I'm not a dick. I'm not like a millionaire showing off money. Oh, You'll man. see me, like, I laugh every time. I'm almost doing this one as well. It was, this is the hardest thing to ever keep a straight face for. It was so difficult. <laughs> I remember the shower, the shower with the money. Oh man. <laughs> look, how, look how young you look, dude. <laughs> with the Watch this tea bag shot. Kaboom. <laughs> Did he just drop it in? Yeah. <laughs> I mean, nah, it was real. No, it was, it was complete, real. It was real. It was real. First tea. <laughs> tea. First tea. <laughs> oh, man. Oh. Yeah, <laughs> it blows up in your screen. Did you have to, like, throw it and then, like, hold it? I can't tell you the secret. Oh, my. Okay. Yeah, it was just magic. It, it, it was, was magic. It was, it was magic. There's like no effects in this video. Did, did you, did you get these co like coffee cups like custom made? Graham bought that for my birthday one year. Just for the bullshit, get out of business. <laughs> we were in group, ready to have a tea bar 22 by 22. Oh man. Could you imagine running 22? By the way, that's the best paint job anyone's ever done on the skewer. What is it? I don't want to comp out on this, but. Well, what, what, what'd you use to paint this? I'll show you one day. Right. Pay me and I'll show you. All right. But that's, Next Undialed video, guys. Oh, and that's where deck pins came from. <laughs> also real, real. That was real. Real. He, he still does that. Like, sometimes we'll be chilling and be like, I'm over you guys. Out. True. Was this one like one of your old local skateboards? <laughs> I know. It was in like a village. My local park. I. I moved to a town for a few years and that was kind of between me and Graham, so we just met up there all the time. I feel it. That park looks hella fun. It's like the old wooden ramp. It kind of looks like Dante Hodgkin's old local park. That's pretty sick. Oh my gosh. Front ice nose one. Double heel front ice? What the heck? Lewis. Back in the day. Front people. Uh, front hard three or 180. <laughs> if anyone's going to cry about a break on a manual, to say it politely, don't bother. That was before breakfast manual was even a thing. This is five years ago, boys and girls. That's what? How did you do a deck grab in after that? Ooh, that was sick. Front fifty. All right. All right. Two seventy. Fake it. All right. Ooh, that was so good. <laughs> this video goes so hard. <laughs> Also real. <laughs> That's how I get to work in that. Still. <laughs> yo, like we just rocked up the airport. Like all of us landed on our plane. We're like, yo, where's Lewis at? Comes in on a meteorite. He's <laughs> just the station. He's like, all right, boys, let's go. Yeah. And that's how the trip started. True story. One thing about this, right? We uh. I want to pause this a sec.
in this bit in the credits, we, we credit James Cameron as visual effects. And that was like a little joke because he's the guy that made Titanic and Avatar. He's like the best grossing director of <laughs> CGI films, right? We made this and I got like, uh, I'm not joking, like 50 or 100 messages on Facebook from random people I don't even know who saw the video and they were like, yo, can your friend James make me a video? No and way. And we were just like, no way. everyone missed the joke. Everyone missed the joke. <laughs> That's like, so disappointing. <laughs> That's like in my in my welcome to district edit. I tagged Katy Perry as one of the filmers Because <laughs> I like had a big crush on Katy Perry at the time and I, I wanted to see if anyone noticed and a few people did I don't know I was so hyped, but that's that's hella funny for just just to give proper credit that that was all Graham Kimball who is <laughs> a master of everything on and off the scooter and like I was in that video, but the effects were him and He killed it the reason the cash is there is just because we sold Union clothes, my old clothing brand, a thing. We had a bag of cash. We were like, we cannot waste this. I was going to film a scooter check anyway, and we were just like, woke up one day, we were like, let's just throw some money around for a bit. And then it turned out quite well. It was, it was, that's the most fun I've ever had making a video. Like, we had so many takes in that just because we would both just start laughing. And we just, and like, even like a week after that, I was filming the Graham's house, even like a week after, like, we would go in like a spare pair of shoes and then there'd be like 50 pounds in there or something. It took a, <laughs> it took a while to collect it all because we just threw it everywhere. Yeah, because you guys- It was just, so careless. No, that's like the exact same thing. Whenever, when we and Clayton, uh, we went, to, I think we went to SD or something, but we made like a lot of cash. And I remember just like, literally as jokes, we would throw stacks of money at each other just to like, like piss each other off. Like it was, it was so ridiculous. I don't know. It, I feel it though. It's just fun to throw money around. It's good. I'm never gonna do it again. <laughs> Real life just hit me, so I can't do that ever again. Facts. I'm just, I'm just a broke old man these facts. days. Just I'm a broke old man. I feel bad. Oh, All right. Man. So what's number three? All right, guys. Wait, wait. This is your, this is your personal YouTube channel. Yeah. Okay. So. 191 <laughs> subs. So, so okay. So so we we just reviewed one of Lewis's old videos from 2013. But you know I'm a I'm an OG at, at what I do. So I filmed one in 2012, and this is this is my first scooter check ever. Um, and it's really funny. This is actually not even on Undialed. This is on my own personal YouTube channel that I still actually use for all my subscriptions, which is kind of bad. But this was made on Will Cashin. If you guys want to go check it out. You guys should go watch it. I have 191 subs, so go show me some love. No, I'm just joking. Yeah, back back from that <laughs> advert. If I, if you had that much money in your video, can you imagine how much money I have in my video? Like, in this one, <laughs> exactly. zero views per hour. Zero. Well, hey, that's why. Wait, you got 40 out of 100 score though. That's. I mean, that's pretty good. That's pretty fat. I. It's not very clickbaited. There's no thumbnail. Um. Let's get into this. Let's all right, go. Alright, let's go. <laughs> you sound like Richard Lincoln. <laughs> it's because I'm using a GoPro. The reason I'm yelling is because I'm using a GoPro. That thing had the worst audio. I have these grips that I took off. Is that why DJ Khaled yells? Uh, <laughs> Probably. Uh, this is my yeah. epic rewind bars with um, fire. The so these these epic rewinds were pretty okay. sick. They're they're at Scooter Zone and like made for Zig Short, but like he uh, never picked them up, so I just snaked them from him. Can they, s while I'm watching this, can they also see the video? Yeah. yeah. Right. Have you noticed how in this video and in the video you're watching right now, he's got exactly the same face? <laughs> like in mine, I look like 50 years younger. And right now, you look like Rich and you put together. <laughs> That's so true. I look so young. Oh man. And this is. You oh. look like six in this video, right? Or five? I just turned seven. Yeah. Uh, they're power coded, which is apparently pretty rare. Which is a lie, all of them are powder coated. Wow. Lying for views, bro. <laughs> I mean, I started young, what can I say? It's really hard to take off off your bars. Okay, that clamp sucked. Like, oh man. Did I see one or something? Right? Yeah. yeah, no, it sucked. That Phoenix Revenge deck was the whole reason I made the scooter check. I was so hyped on it. Phoenix. Yeah, it's really good. Guess. Just a fork. Um. I have to rep area cycles. That was my local yeah, bike shop who started carrying awesome. like, like bike, or like there was a bike shop that started carrying scooters. Like Eagle Sport 110 spoke. Back when it was Eagle Sport, not even Eagle Supply. Shout out to Eagle. 
Black. Thank you, Keelan. This is my best friend at the time. You were what sending this. I, I don't know. I just I was just Don't hyped up my thumb. As soon as I did that, I was like, "Why am I doing this?" I just think you ever took that. Autograph. Brandon Smith. That was the nice. I don't think you like Phoenix. <laughs> he signed it upside down, and I was so bummed. I was like, "It's upside down. No one can read it." Look at this. Look at this. So I do my finger whips, it won't hurt. I put foam grip on the back of my deck so when I slap finger whips, it wouldn't hurt. That's such a. Oh, I can't swear on this, but that, that's a lame move. That's such a hard part. You'd hear, you hear the worst part about it. I didn't land a finger up to like two years after this video was made. It was just for the flex. I got him in a trade. Mark Pig in the back. And you guys ready to hear this drop test? No, we're ready, Will. We are ready to hear this. Go on. Alright, not very dialed, but. I knew it was dialed. That was dialed. It was? That's why your current YouTube is called this, right? <laughs> That's it. not even a clip. That's it. That was my scooter check. Wow. So, like, I, like, remember, I remember, like, so if I say in the video, I was like, I was like, thanks, Keelan, for uh, sending me these pegs. Like, in reality, I was just competing with him at the time because he had made a scooter check, and, and we were, like, super competitive about having a dialed scooter. So I was like, Oh, it's not, it's not very dialed, but I, I had literally gone before making that video and tightened everything in my scooter so it would be perfectly dialed for the drop test. Not very dialed, but like, I, I sucked. <laughs> I, was a, I was a lame kid. <laughs> Alright guys, well, those are the scooter checks from today. Hope you, hopefully you guys enjoyed it. Thanks, Lewis, for being on Undialed. It, yeah, yeah. It's been really sick. Watching some old scooter checks, so I appreciate oh, it, man. It's good. They were they were fun. I didn't see those other two before, so heck yeah. I enjoyed that far away one. The far away because one. That was the gift that kept on giving. Yeah, it like, was. I was like, he's probably like fifty meters away. And then, and then it was just, just, it was just going like back miles. farther and farther. Oh my gosh. That was tight. That was sick. All right, guys. Hey, you want Richard? You want to say hi? Richard's here. Hi. <laughs> <laughs> Alright guys. You, you, you totally did. Alright guys, well, make sure to like, share, subscribe. Hopefully you enjoyed the video. Uh, make sure to go to undialed.co, pick up some merch, pick up some stickers, buy some district parts from the scooter farm and use code undialed to save 10%. So, hope you guys enjoyed. Catch you later. Peace out.